Well, remember that in 2019, there was only like two hybrid tires. And now all of a sudden, everybody's got a hybrid tire. So everybody's either in development on one or is releasing one. Like think of all the ones like the Mickey Thompson's we did, the Dick Cepex we did, the Coopers we did. You know, back in, you know, back in 19, there was basically Ridge Grappler was brand new and you had the Duratrac from Goodyear, which was really not designed to be a hybrid tire, but ended up being one of the flagship tires of that category. One of the better tires that Goodyear makes is the Duratrac. And so like, you know, Nitto and Toyo, and there was the Toyo Open Country RT. The, you know, those were kind of the pioneers because, you know, Nitto and Toyo really started to explore the different, were there categories in between the regular category of HT, AT, and MT? And then, you know, what's an MT? And also like what conditions and what different MTs can be used for different terrain. You can't just have one MT, right, or one AT, because you have all kinds of different terrains. Like some people were in the sand or in desert. Some people were in the mud. Some people were on the rocks, like in Moab. Some people are using them to work on, you know, power lines in Florida after hurricanes. So like there's different, there's all kinds of different uses. And the marketing people at Nitto said that let's explore these different categories and, and be, if we're going to be a truck tire line, which we clearly are, let's cover all the bases and all the categories of that truck tire line to deliver the best customer experience that we can, become a lifestyle brand and start to become popular as a lifestyle brand and not necessarily as much as a tire brand. So the guys that took over the marketing at Toyo and, and Nitto really hit the you know, hit a home run with that stuff. Cause they kind of looked outside the boundaries of traditionally how tires were designed. And they were more designed from an engineering standpoint and not so much a aesthetics and marketing standpoint or custom standpoint. And so what's happened is the other brands have followed suit and copied the, you know, copied the wave and said, okay, well, here's an emerging tire, tire category called hybrid and everybody's sort of coming out on because not everybody wants an MT because they're so loud and they don't last very long. But for some people, an AT is just not enough. Just not enough. And so just a different category. And I, you know, that's a lot of it. And so you see a wave of new, from every manufacturer, you'll see a wave of new uh, hybrid tires coming. And this is just one of them. If you're new to Campus Automotive, we do tire comparisons, tire reviews, and lots of tire talk. So subscribe and hit the bell to keep up.